day one, they sold. We show you everything. I must thank Medic. We take Thanks for watching. Out of restoration. Take two. Take one. Take two. Take two. All right, thank you, ladies. Thank you, ladies. Really. Introducing Matt's 1972 Mach 1. Here we go, guys. But that is kind of odd. No trans dipstick. Discovery process, guys. That's what it is. What's the level? Doesn't smell burnt, Mike says, which is good news. Came with Ram Air too. Nice. Do that again, flip it over. She's low. She's low. Thank God. Alright, let's put uh put that put that whole quarter type F in there. That would, that would give us reverse. So she's down a quart on transmission fluid, and we need to do a trans dipstick for this 351. The idle's high too. It's like good. I don't know if it's a C4 or a C6. I'm not, I'm not sure. All right, fluid going in. There goes our security right there, which is kind of nice. They drive by every 15 minutes by the shop and look at it, which you know I'm, I'm happy about for security reasons. That should give us reverse. We're going to check the level after putting a full cord in of Type F. Let's see what we got. She's a beauty, one in a million, girl, but don't fall in love. Sometimes I think these cars are as high maintenance as some of our wives. I said some of our wives, right? I'm politically correct on that, I think. Hopefully my wife won't be around when I'm heading to the video. Now she's good. All right, I hope I, hope I got reverse. Yeah. All right, here we go. I'm gonna put her in reverse now. Want me to leave the dipstick? All right, here we go. Nice. All right, oil pressure is good, temp is good, alternator is good. All right, here we go. Tachometer's working. Tech's right here. It's a little loose on the front end. Possible minor, possible minor exhaust leak. Creaky in the front, could be ball joints. All right, here we go. Front end alignment. Look at the front end alignment. It's way off. First test drive. Going through all our gears. Brakes are good, no real pulling. Seems to be shifting smoothly. I know she's in third gear. She's got a minor.
fracture on the lens right here. There's a fracture on the fuel lens on the on the shield. Those are replaceable. They've got those. You can replace that plastic. Mm -hmm. Here we go. I'm going to stop and try reverse. Here, show reverse down here. Oh, we, got we got reverse. We got reverse. Matt, <laughs> yeah. I'm like, oh no, no, no. We get the car back. We don't have reverse. All right. It sounds like I think that what happened is the transmission you needed that cord to go. Here we go. We're gonna reverse. Is it shifting linkage? This thing is so loose. Okay. It's shifting linkage. It's not the trans, I think. We just had great reverse, right? Yeah. We both we got it on video, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. You got it. Now I can't find it. All right. We got a linkage problem underneath, but we got reverse. Yeah. That means a lot of things are working inside the trans. That's good news. I was like, I do not want to make the phone call to Matt. Now he can watch this video and go, yay, with us on video. MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration out of restoration. Say it only has surface rust? Really? Please look for the link in the description below for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon.